How to take care of nuisance wildlife, rodent, and pest problems. This is Ed with Critic Control of Ter Tampa Bay. There's a number of things that would help to repel mice. But first of all, remember the biology of the animal. A tremendous sense of nose. Their olfactory senses are fantastic. So anything that smells a little off is going to probably repel them. You could even start with bleach, cleaning, improving the sanitation. That's going to help to get rid of the mice. Naphthalene, mothballs, that's a fumigant, so be careful. There's a lot of people out there that are allergic to it, that are hypersensitive to naphthalene. You may have to take it all out of the attic if you threw it up there. I wouldn't use it to repel the mice. If you do, make sure you put it into a nylon sock tie it off with a string, and then put it where you want the odor. But you know what? The scents that repel mice are just going to move them. They're going to move them two feet or 20 feet. Mice don't travel an awful long way, so you still have your problem. You still have to take care of the food, the water, and the shelter, which are the attractions for the mice in the first place. So if you're using a fumigant like naphthalene, if you're using ammonia, if you're cleaning with bleach, boy, make sure you're not fooling yourself by just trying to use a scent to repel those mice. If you're having problems, call a professional. This is Ed with Critic Control in Tampa Bay.